Gonna boy say he want marry me oh. I hope say I be cuckoo at you Hope your love go sweet past the shit oh. Baby boy they say he think my body is a killer oh. I hope say I be cuckoo at you Hope his love go sweet past the shit oh. Hi guys, welcome back again to my channel. If you are new, I am Susanita Avi. Today's video, you guys, is just a video that I created. I just don't feel like recording, but I decided to do it anyway. So you guys, I'm just going to be like talking here and there whilst I do my makeup. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please, if you are not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. If you are not following me on Instagram, Go follow me on Instagram, okay? <laughs> you guys, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Leave your comments down below and let's go right into the video. You guys, I'm going to go right into this tutorial, okay? I'm going to talk you guys through, I don't know if I should call this video or get ready with me kind of video, but anyways, I'm just going to do a quick recording and let's go right into the tutorial. First, you guys, I'm going to like, I'm just going to prime my face. Like, I got this nyx primer i got this primer i'm just going to use it to like it's like a primer base oh, i know you guys you also have situation like you have times you know everyone we all have time where we don't feel like recording so next i'm going to go in with my primer this primer is from classic uh, you've seen me use this primer before in several of my videos you guys I'm just going to take a little bit of it. You guys, this video, I <laughs> just enjoy it, okay? Just enjoy it whilst we do the talking. So, after applying my primer, I'm just going to wait like a couple of seconds. So, next thing I'm going to do is just like take my concealer, this black upper concealer. I'm just going to use it to conceal some of the parts in my face where I still have the black spot and sunburn. You guys, I want to know from you guys, how do you deal with stress? Like, how do you handle times where you feel down, when you don't feel like doing anything, you just don't feel like going out, you don't feel like being productive? How do you guys handle it? Like, this, for a long time, I've not been in this type of situation, but all of a sudden, I just noticed that I am just not in the mood to do anything. So after applying my black upper concealer, I'm just going to, like, take also my normal... I'm going to take my my MAC Studio Fix Fluid Concealer. This one is in the shade NC45. Yeah. Just tell me, how do you handle stress? You know, sometimes also, I don't know if I should blame this also some uh, like on social media. Like sometimes when we, um, yeah, this I'm just using my concealer brush to like go over my face. Sometimes when you just look at social media, like in general, you're like, Sometimes, <laughs> I think social media has its own good side and social media has its own bad side. I just, of late, I just told myself that when I wake up in the morning, I try to like take one to two hours before I pick up my phone and then I go on social media or to check my YouTube channel, like to, to see if I get a comment or maybe my Instagram page. It, I just take a lot of time because I realize when I go to my when I go to my, my Instagram page and then I see my followers are so small and then sometimes I get so sad or maybe I look at my YouTube channel and then I get just one subscriber and then it, it affects my mood. So I decided that whether I get followers or not, whether I get comments or not, I'm still going to do my videos, I'm still going to put out my content there because I know growth, it doesn't take overnight. It's going to take time. People that are big today, when I hear their stories, are like, it takes some people it took them years some people it took them overnight one video like going like viral and then boom here them here they go like they are well known and so i just want to tell you guys young people out there don't just put pressure on yourself don't don't kill yourself what will be will be if you get there you get it don't kill yourself i've told myself girl whether you get subscribers or not whether they like your video or not you're just going to do your content make your content make yourself happy and just let it flow what is it it's not a do or die affair makeup is something that i love doing i love acting i just love entertainment i love doing stuff that i like so even before i started my youtube channel i've always loved makeup and i've always loved acting and i've always loved to be funny so because i'm putting it out there now for people to see and it doesn't mean that I, whether they like it or not i'm going to like 
kill myself because they don't like because they don't subscribe i'm just going to like allow that one depress me or something mm -mm. i'm going to enjoy myself i will not let it get to me at all because what will be will be so if you are hearing if you are listening to me <laughs> don't kill yourself or don't kill yourself at all what will be will be okay you guys also i'm using daylight i'm using daylight I, I i don't know i think the sun is just going here and there so probably the quality of this video might not be the best but i am still going to record it and i'm still going to upload it anyways so so let me talk to you uh there is something that i also want to talk to you guys about you guys recently i'm going to now to like use my beauty blender to blend my face recently you guys i was talking with a friend of mine and we were just like we were just chatting and this girl she was telling me stuff like how she handles stress and i'm like oh i would like i would love to hear it how do you handle stress and she was like oh <clears throat> when i'm stressed i just like when i'm stressed i just smoke and then i drink and then it helps to like calm me down and <laughs> for me i was really i was like you guys i was totally shocked like i was shocked like how is it that cigarettes calms ones like when you're stressed how how or like how and she was like trying to like talk me into it yeah when you just smoke one cigarette and you'll be calm you'll feel very good or just take two bottles of beer <laughs> hey you guys in my mind in my mind i was just like telling myself um, like my shoes my shoes were like if my shoes could run like i mean my legs if my legs could just like run i would have run out of that place because i was like really you guys when they say uh, evil communication it corrupts good manner believe me it does and i was just wondering i was just i wasn't like are you guys Okay. I was wondering like is it that I wasn't hearing where what she was saying or what's like how can you expect me to like start smoking and drinking all of a sudden? I don't smoke, I don't drink and then because I want to calm myself now, like because I really like I just I for me I just felt a little bit uncomfortable because looking at myself looking at myself and then Imagining myself that all of a sudden I will start I will start smoking for what and I'll start drinking for what and you know I, I was trying to explain to her that listen when you smoke and then you drink it's fine I don't know how that feels anyways, but you calm down But when those things are gone, I was trying to like put myself in that position and then I was telling her that listen if I do that even if I calm down when my eyes are clear, maybe the cigarette I am high, like I, 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 she said, oh, you go high and then you forget about everything. I'm like, okay, I'll go high. When the highness is gone, when my eyes are clear again, my problem is still there, waiting for me, smiling at me. So what's the use of it? Is it not better I deal with my problems, find a solution for it than soaking myself in alcohol, soaking myself in cigarettes? She was just like trying to give me reasons, like reasons why I should do it. You guys, in my mind, I was just praying, God, let my train come and let me go because I just, she couldn't convince me. I just also couldn't convince her to like, we, we both couldn't colonize each other. So we just like left the conversation there halfway and I left and she also left. I was going, I was wondering, I said, God, hmm? this is how it starts. She was even offering me one cigarette. Uh, one cigar. <laughs> she was even offering me one cigarette. Like, you guys, like, mm -hmm. I don't have anything against smokers. Don't get me wrong. I don't have anything against smokers. But like, my only problem is I don't smoke and if because I have issues or because I have challenges in life, I'm going to use that as an escape route. That is what I have problems with, like using alcohol or smoking as an escape route for my problems. That is what I have problems. Like I cannot, I don't, I like, I, I don't see the connection. I just don't see the connection. So don't get me wrong. Like 
I don't have anything against people that smoke. <laughs> so if you think smoking or uh, drinking alcohol is going to help you escape your problems, I don't think it's will for me. So I'm just not even going to go in that. So you guys, now I'm going to take my I'm going to take my concealer. This is also Max Studio Finish Concealer in the shade A27. I'm just going to use my concealer to you guys I know this one this makeup today is just one that I'm doing because I'm not in the mood but I have to do it anyways because I feel sometimes it's when you are not in the mood that is when you just like you just do it so what do you guys think? Do you think when you drink, am I even, is this, this thing still clear? Okay. You guys, leave your comments down below. Let me know, do you think alcohol and smoking, like, what is your experience like? Have you tried it before, like when you have problems, like you are really stressed or you are really feeling a kind of depressed, a kind of, did alcohol save you? Did cigarettes did smoking cigarettes did it help you solve your problem like really i i don't understand it so you guys just let me know leave your comments below let me know what you guys what you think if truly smoking really solves people's problem because <laughs> even though the, like me saying it right now i feel kind of a little bit awkward you know So you guys just leave your comments down below. I don't know. This it's kind of looks strange right here. Like it's like the autofocus is. Guys, this video is just like this is what I do just when I'm in a hurry or when I'm not in the mood of doing makeup. I said this over and over again. Okay, stop it. Now it's enough. And also you guys I want to say thank you to you guys thank you so so much for your love for your support thank you for the well thank you to my new subscribers like thank you guys so so much like your comments your likes sharing my videos like you guys thank you you know there is nothing that makes one so happy when you take time to like record a video edit and then upload and then you see people commenting you see people liking it it like it motivates you like everyone we need motivation one way or the other there was this small youtube i'm also a small youtuber come on hey hello <laughs> like i want to say small youtuber like i am one big youtuber <laughs> anyways we'll get there we'll definitely get there one day but anyways there is this youtuber that i i subscribed to her channel and then it's actually a makeup channel and you guys like I feel really I don't know but should I even be saying this should I be talking about this but anyway I just don't know I just feel like she's been there for a very long time and the those the subscribers are just the same like months over months just the same I just feel I, I can imagine but one thing I like about her motivation is that her subscribers are very small like you guys this, this makeup that I'm doing today. Hmm. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm still going to do it anyways. So, her subscribers, it's been like for months, it's been like 20 or so. And then sometimes I feel she, and she really, like, she, um, she uploads video. She uploads, um, she upload, upload. <laughs> she uploads regular content. And then I'm like, ah. Sometimes I just I cannot imagine and I'm like well Motivation is the key. Oh. Motivation is the key whether they subscribe or not. Just keep doing your thing And this girl I'm really happy for her because I see even if the subscribers are not moving she keeps uploading content like she keeps uploading and moving and one day I was looking at her channel and then something struck me so now I'm just going to go in with my favorite 
you guys you know this palette like if you've been watching my makeup video you know this palette until this palette gets empty i'll keep using it <laughs> So you guys, one day I was watching uh, her, one of her video, and I'm just going to use this one right here, this very dark one. So as I was watching the video, something just struck me and I was like, you see, even if her channel is not growing, like even if it's been the same months over months, she still keeps, she like she keeps uploading, she keeps putting content out there and hopefully one day, She'll grow so and then that even got me motivated you know so you guys I'm just going to say <coughs> excuse me today this video I, I like this video I will be honest with you guys I didn't feel like it but I am just pushing myself forcing myself that I have to do this because you know sometimes the enemy try to like press you down the enemy try to suppress you the enemy try to like make sure make you feel like like I don't know but sometimes the enemy is so crafty that I, well if you if you if you if as a Christian I call the devil my enemy so maybe as I don't know what your religion is I don't know who maybe you don't have an enemy but yeah so the enemy as i was saying try to like put you down try to make you feel depressed like for no reasons i've been asking myself for no reasons yeah for no reason for no reason at all i i've been like asking myself all week like what what is going on so you guys i'm just going in with the same very dark powder to like I've been asking myself, like, what is actually going on? Why is it that I am not motivated at all? What is it? I still cannot find answer. No answer, oh, no answer. But that is just the strategy of the enemy to make you feel weak, to make you feel depressed for nothing, and then try to steal your joy. So you see, at the beginning of this video, I was not in the mood at all, but I can see my makeup going slowly, and I can see that I'm talking to you guys and I know I'm going to encourage someone out there today no matter how you feel if you don't feel like doing it or if you are scared of doing it do it anyways do it afraid do it you might not come up with the best result like as I'm looking at this makeup I feel like this is not like I could do better you know I could do better but I'm going to do it anyways so you guys now I'm going to like go in with also I've concealed my under eye I'm just going to also go in now with my Sasha buttercup setting powder Yeah, this is the Sasha buttercup setting powder. I'm going to go in with this powder and yeah So as I was saying to you guys sometimes we feel very very depressed like we feel very depressed You just feel like you don't want to do anything It's just the plan of the enemy to keep you just to keep you there. I Just don't feel like standing up. I'm going to use the same beauty blender to like go under my eyes so you guys that is it when you're afraid of doing it do it anyways when you don't feel like doing it but you know it's the best thing for you go for it and now as I slowly put on my makeup I'm thinking of stepping out yes I think I'm going to take myself out for dinner it's yeah I think so because slowly you see you see Stella is getting a groove back She's getting a groove back. <laughs> so you guys, I just want to like, I'm so happy, like I'm happy like YouTube. Today YouTube is giving a lot of people opportunity to like share their talents, to share their experiences, to like talk about things that I'm just so grateful like being, uh, like I'm just, I'm so happy. Like you know, if there was no YouTube today or I was not a YouTuber or I didn't decide to like join this platform imagine like me being bored at home I'll just be bored and yeah I know sometimes you'll be like oh when you're bored you call friends some friends they also have their own problem like so me these days I try to limit how I I just try to limit how I like call people and pack, unpack my own problem because they have their problems yes it's good sometimes to like tell people your problems or 
call them so that they will encourage you but sometimes you need to encourage yourself believe me you just need to like encourage your own self because people we all have problems whether you like it or not a has a problem b has a problem c has a problem we all have problems so we have to learn to like learn to be able sometimes to like <clears throat> Just to handle our stuff ourselves you know i used to have this friend before that so i'm just going to wait for it Let, let's just talk let's just talk guys a little bit whilst i wait for this to like cake 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 <laughs> so i used to have this friend before like we lost contact now anyways but like this girl she'll be like all the time like she never says anything good about herself she won't the only thing she sees about herself is negative as in in my whole life, I've never seen someone who's so neg. Like, you know, I have got life has taught me that, like, I try as much as possible, as much as possible, not to say anything negative about myself because I know people are saying negative, negative, negative. <laughs> people are saying negative. Oh, people are saying negative things about me. Yeah, and that's true. People will definitely see negativity even in your positivity. Like, no matter how good you try to be, people will see something bad in it so whilst i talk to you guys let me also continue with this makeup so i've tried on my own i try as much as possible not to say negative things about me the ones people are saying about me is enough so when i add my own to it i'm not encouraging myself rather i'm making the problem worse so let people keep saying negative things about me me too i'll say positive things about myself and yeah that's the only way you can grow but if you keep saying negative things about yourself and people are also saying negative things about you who are you helping you are not helping yourself i heard one motivational speaker say that sometimes the only good thing you will ever hear about yourself is are the good things you say to yourself so why add why say negative things about yourself when others are already saying negative see like it or not people will say bad things about you that one you can't dodge it so you guys this girl should always say negative things about herself and always say negative things about herself i try to tell her i said babe listen sometimes things she says about herself are like things that normally i know they are not as bad as she think like sometimes oh my leg is too tiny like i have the most ugly leg in the world i'm like babe come listen they have people who does not have legs like people are living with their leg without legs they will be so glad if they can have your leg for one day to walk only to walk with your legs for one day <laughs> it's like a dream for them and then you have this legs very for me the legs were like you, you guys for me her legs were like like supermodel legs but she finds every reason to like tell you that her legs are the worst the most terrible legs you ever find in the planet so you know she will always say negative things about herself and I just, within me, I will just like, God help her, God help her because it's only God that can help people like that. <laughs> Nothing you say or do will make them see posit anything positive about themselves and she will always say, oh, only bad things happen to me. And then, you guys, how is this makeup going? I don't even know, I'm talking, talking, talking. So one day I was talking to her and I was like, listen, and she'll always complain, nothing would happen to me. I'm just going to also go in again with this because I realized like I over, it's looking kind of white. So I'm just going to, to define my cheekbone and also my forehead a little bit. So one day we were talking and then she was like, well, only bad thing happened to me. You, you are lucky, good things are always happening to you. I said, babe, come listen, don't ever say that again because me too, I have bad things that are happening to me, but it's just like I don't go blowing the trumpet, trumpets and I uh, announce it to everybody. I have, I also have my own blows from life, but I don't announce it to everybody. So the fact that you announce yours, it doesn't mean that we that don't announce our own, we don't have bad days. We all do, but you have to learn to deal with it. You have to learn to appreciate yourself. Uh, there is a saying in my language that says Tare Taku Isadora Okwaka <laughs> Yeah, that's my modern language It means like no matter how like you can talk from now to tomorrow the person who wants to see see 
what will be would be like what will be will be like you can talk from now to tomorrow that's my what will be will be so like i tried to convince this girl before we lost contact i tried to make her see good things about herself but all my efforts were totally in vain and you guys before i continue with this video i want to show you guys i forgot i got some new brushes these brushes i got them from amazon yeah so guys i am back i've already done my brows off camera so now i'm going to go in with my eyeshadow and then quickly wrap up this look i'm going to go in with this eyeshadow so you guys as i was saying before i went to do my brows off camera i can't really remember the last thing i said <laughs> i know it happens to us all the time right when you when you're talking about something and then you get like you you take a break and then you can't remember what you were saying anyways the essence of this video is to let you guys know that even when you don't feel like doing it but you think and you believe it's the right thing for you go for it just do it so you guys do you have any friend you guys leave your comments down below let me know do you have any friend who is very very negative like what do you guys think when you if you've had a friend or you have a friend who is a very negative person what do you think is the best solution for someone? Is it not, for me, I think just pray for them. That's what I think. Just pray for them because I've had one and I tried. I gave books, audio tapes, tried to take her to church, but nothing changed. So what do you guys think is the best way to like help a person who is very, like a negative person? What's the best way to help, to help such one? What do you guys think is the best way? So... I'm just going to hurry up with this look you guys because I don't want to like I've been talking too much today <laughs> but sometimes talking to help you release stress you know that when you talk it helps you to ease yourself and then you are back again so I'm so happy I like I'm happy I made this I, I'm recording this video you guys I am so happy my mood is changing and I don't know what's wrong with the lights natural light is something that is good but you really cannot count on it to 100 percent it just keeps changing i'm learning to talk you guys to talk whilst doing my makeup every everyone who knows me they know that when i'm doing my makeup hey hey don't even dare talk to me because if i draw my eyebrow wrongly you'll be head responsible <laughs> I remember I almost had a quarrel with a friend because I told her several times, please don't talk, I'm drawing my brows, I need to concentrate. She kept on talking and then I made a mistake, Ha! Oh! I heard her response, but I said you caused it because if you were quiet, I for concentrate, draw the thing well, now you caused them. So, what do you guys think about this look? I think I am done. Oh, I just don't want to make it. Or should I go? Let me go in with some little yellow. Yellow. <laughs> If you are in Ghana, I know when you have like kind of fair when you are fair or maybe you have light skin, they call you yellow. Yellow, sister, yellow. <laughs> okay, enough playing. Let me be serious more. Wow. You guys, can you see the difference? Like, look at this one here and this one. I think I should add a little bit of that yellow again. I'm just going to line my waterline. With this black this one is from David so I think it's okay I'm just going to highlight my face and then the look is ready 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 so this one is also from PS this highlighter this one is from the, it's the good rush edition from PS my Catrice liner. I'm just going to line my lips. Next, I'm going in with my Lustry lipstick. I got this one from Primer. I'm just not feeling the slip at all. So I'm going to apply a lip gloss on top of it just to make it look very soft because I feel it's too... I just feel it's... 
I don't know, but I feel it's too. Let me just apply my lipstick. Lip gloss. This lip gloss is from Manhattan. It's from Manhattan. So guys, here is the finished look. <laughs> you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. If you are not subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to my channel. Okay, so you guys, if you are not following me on Instagram, go and follow me on Instagram. Please leave your comments down below. Let me know, let a sister know. When you are depressed, when you are sad, how do you handle it? Like when you don't feel like doing anything, even when you know doing something as the best option, but you just don't feel like it, how do you handle it? Leave your comments down below regarding all that I have talked about in this video. I know that this video was kind of, or like I was just all over the place you guys but you know sometimes we all feel like talking I wasn't in the mood of doing this video but I ended up doing it anyways and now I feel happy and I will be stepping out so you guys I will see you guys in my next video bye guys <laughs>